Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. <laughs> ah, well, I wasn't expecting any visitors today. Hello there! And what would be the pleasure of me seeing you right now? Ah, yes, everyone wants to talk to the famous radio demon himself. Ah, but... If you don't mind coming back later, I was in the middle of brunch. <sighs> well, if it's so important, I guess I could put my brunch to a halt for now. So, what is it that you need? Oh, really? <laughs> well, it so happens to be that I am one of the most powerful demons that are around here. Yes, yes, indeed, I do have some power behind me. <laughs> oh, you want someone dead? <laughs> well, I could deal with that quite easily. Oh. Humanely? Well, that's a lot less fun. But I can see what I can do. But it will cost you. Ha 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 ha! No! Keep your foul money to yourself. And plus, I don't know where have you been, so I don't know where that money has been. I was thinking more, hmm, accordance to a deal. I help you kill this person alongside with a little bit more of, mm, how do you say, upgrades to your mm, current state. And, in exchange, you will help me with anything that I find difficult or I plan on not doing by myself. And so, let me repeat myself. In exchange for power, you become one of me. As in I own your soul. As long as you do not break this contract, you will absolutely have all of my power. That is, if you stay up to date with the contract, that is. Yes, it is reasonable enough, but I understand if you are having a bit of doubt. So, why don't you and I talk for a little bit, and then we can discuss doing sorts of business together. <laughs> Fantastic! Come on, sit, sit! Although I was having brunch, I do not mind having guests. So, get into more detail about this person that you want me to absolutely fucking kill. Ah, rivalry! Best entertainment ever since that colored television thing always showed up everywhere. Although I despise the wretched thing, I do quite find some of the colored shows quite entertaining at times. Mm-hmm. You could go into details about 
how you want to rip this person's head clean off their shoulders and put it on a pike. But, like I said, I was in the middle of brunch and I do not want my food getting warmed up by sun. So please, I am begging you, please speed up the process of how you are going to kill him. Or them. I don't know. Their gender. Especially around these days. Anyone could be anything. They could be a him, her, elephant. It doesn't matter, as long as they're happy. And also, society really doesn't really care what you call yourself anymore. Hell, you could even call yourself a rhinoceros. It still doesn't matter to the people, as long as you're happy. That's what people are going for nowadays. As long as you're happy, you'll be fine. When in reality, that is not what happens. Especially around my time. See, when I was alive... Right. I am a little bit of a blabbermouth now, am I? Ha 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 ha. Oh, I am sorry. This problem was about you, not me. So please, continue. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Interesting. So, let me get this straight. Your arch enemy and rival is a cannibal. Well, do they live in Cannibal Town? I don't see why you want to kill this person. The cannibals are actually quite friendly. I know a few of them myself. I'm specially friends with the mayor of that town as well. She could never hurt a fly. Well, besides to her late husband, but that's sides the point. Why would you want to kill a cannibal? Oh, I see. You both died together. Now, you didn't say that, now did you? So, how did both of you die? <laughs> oh, fighting over a woman. So, so pitiful and yet so manly at the same time. It is the purest of action. True love against one. While there's two... You could say it was quite a love triangle. <laughs> you say that this woman or person was yours. But that cannibal also says that they are theirs as well. I can see where you are conflicted. And you just want her or him to yourself. Am I right? Hmm. Although I really do enjoy the cannibal's company. And also it'll make me look bad for the mayor. Hmm. All right, how about this? If you can get the cannibal out of Cannibal Town, and then go into the more other sides of the city, of hell, then you could kill them. Because I don't want the presence of myself to be inside of Cannibal Town due to a murder. I do have quite a reputation I have to keep a hold, and if there is some ruffian who was a cannibal starts murdering innocent hell spawn, then I would have to step in and kill them myself because that's what the mayor would want. Because over in Cannibal Town, they are quite friendly. So, if a cannibal goes out of line, I'm usually the first one to hear about it. So, how about this? Going back to the whole deal thing, I give you an extension of my power, you get that little cannibal 
away from Cannibal Town, and then you can kill them. Do we have a deal then? <laughs> yes, perfect. I'm glad to be doing business with you. Now, how about you get yourself prepared for this whole little surprise you're going to pull on this said person? And I enjoy my brunch. Alrighty. Thank you for your time. Ta-ta! <laughs>